Mr. Muthoni. The body of missing Somali-American national Bashir Mohammed has been found at the Kirigoya Level 5 Hospital Mochri. According to Kirinyaga County Police Commander Lea Kithei, the body was discovered by a resident from Mirera in Mirundiko Ward, Mwea, on May 16th, 2021, three days after he disappeared. After a week of living in anguish and anxiety, the family of missing Somali-American national Bashir Mohammed have found their loved one dead. Three days after his disappearance, Bashir's body was found on Saturday last week on the river banks of River Nyaminde in Kirinyaga County. It had deep panga cut wounds in the head and two bullet wounds on the head. In a statement, the family lawyer said, and I quote, it is with heavy heart that the family of Bashir Muhammad Muhammad informs you that the body of Bashir was found earlier on today, which is Saturday, at Kerugoya Level 5 Hospital. As the family processes this tragic news and plans for his burial, they request that they be afforded privacy. Even as Bashir rests, the family shall not rest until justice has been served and those responsible for his death brought to book. End of quote. Police are expected to conduct a post-mortem on his body tomorrow, with the matter having been referred to the Gareti Investigation Office, where it was initially reported. Detectives are also probing how Bashir's vehicle, a Range Rover, was found burnt in Kibiko, in Gong area, three days after his disappearance. The puzzle remained on how the shell of the vehicle was carted away in less than an hour after a police officer from Kibiko Police Post visited the scene and went back to alert the scene of crime officers. The businessman went missing on May 13th. That evening, he had driven into Miala Launch in Lavington. At 6.49 p.m., the black Range Rover he was driving, registration number KCQ007P, is seen driving off from the facility with the guards waving by. A few seconds after leaving, his vehicle stopped, his car seemingly obstructed by another vehicle. During that hour captured by surveillance footage, Bashir tried to call his wife, but the call was interrupted and his phone confiscated in what is presumed to have been a scuffle. The structural engineer and proprietor of Infinity Developers, based in Nairobi, was an American citizen who had lived in the state of Ohio. The 35-year-old American citizen had interest in construction projects and has been working on different government.